Take a deep breath, Rick. We should have the MR results back any second now. My knee! I, I can't bend it. Something is not right here. I never felt this, this level of pain. You just landed awkwardly. The knee is swelling as can be expected. We'll know more shortly. Well, how can this happen to me? How can this happen tonight in the playoffs? I was feeling it, you know. What did I have, like 30 points? Well, you were up to 36. Don't worry about that right now. Just focus on your breathing. What if... Ah. Bradley, Rick, I just got the MRI results. Now, mind you, everything I'm about to say is early, but our initial diagnosis is a full tear of the anterior cruciate ligament and partial tears of the posterior cruciate ligament and collateral cruciate ligament. What does that mean? My ACL is torn? I never even heard of those ligaments before. Rick, it's very unusual to suffer injuries to these ligaments in the same knee simultaneously. The collateral cruciate ligament in particular is generally only injured due to the direct blow of the inside of the knee which pushes it sideways. When the knee gets, thank you James, we get the idea. Let's focus on making Rick comfortable. We will need to perform another MRI in a few days once the swelling starts to subside. Only then we really know what we're up against. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to get more opinions on these results. What does that mean for my career? How long will it take before I get to go back on the court? Rick, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. This isn't great. The good news is I've seen players come back from far worse than this. Mr. Blake, I've just arrived. A little traffic on the way here. I should be inside in a few minutes. Rick, I'm a man that likes to capitalize on every moment and makes the most of it. So let's make the most of this moment. Yes, of course, sir. I guess I want to go over what is on the agenda for today. Of course, it's your first day on the job. There will be a lot of hosts of meet and greets. You can imagine the number of people in the organization that want to meet the legendary Rick Redman in person, right? Simple enough. If only that were it. The hard part will be introductory press conference with the media. We schedule for about 2 p.m. session to introduce you. The media around you aren't ones for pleasantries. They're going to come out hard at you. They're going to ask you pointed questions. How you respond to these questions will lay the foundation of what you're going to accomplish here. Mr. Blake, I can see Terry and Lillard are about to head into the facility. Do you mind if I catch up with them real quick to introduce myself? Please, call me Scott. And by all means, I'll see you in a few minutes. Terry, Damien, wait up. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Rick Redman, the new GM of the team. Mr. Redman, welcome. If I was a huge fan of yours back in your playing days, I can't tell you how excited I am that the team hired you. I really feel like hiring a GM that has, you know, been in the league, that has gone through what it's like for us players, it'll be great for the organization. You will have the respect of the players, I can tell you that much. Thank you, Damien. To be honest, I'm a big fan of yours as well. I'm looking forward to seeing what we can do together. Mr. Redman, it's an honor. I've been asking Mr. Blake if you've given him any indication if you have planned on bringing our own staff or if you'd like to go on what's going on here. Terry, we haven't discussed staffing at this point. Right now, we are just in a get to know each other phase. But let me tell you, I like you. I think you're a smart guy. I know you have the respect of the players in the locker room. Coach is definitely a player's coach. He wants to win. I want to win. That's what I'm here for. That's what we are all here for, right? I'm looking for a big year. We have a great group of guys. I am as well. If you excuse me, I need to get to Mr. Blake's office. Apparently, I have a big first day. Scott, my apologies for being late. It's quite alright, Rick. Have a seat. Hey, did Viv offer you one of her world famous chai latte spice scones on the way in? They're out of this world. I must have missed. In fact, they inspire me to build an app that lets you know in real time when you've added too much of an ingredient when preparing foods. It's next level stuff. We've got some kinks to work out like how you keep your phone pointing at your batter while you're actually adding ingredients. But anyways, you said you saw Terry Little on the way in. Yeah, 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 good guys. I got to introduce myself, but didn't really get to talk much. You have plenty of time to get to know the team. Rick, I just want to officially, in person, welcome you as the new GM of the Trailblazers. Well, I don't know you. Well, I don't know you don't have a lot of experience as a GM. I've been watching you for a long time, first as a player, then as an assistant GM, and I must say, you're very impressed. Why, well, thank you, sir. 
I remember May 17, 2011 well. It was a sad day. You were playing in Dallas and you had 30 something points midway through that third quarter? Well, uh, 36 to be exact. Sir. Right, right. Well, I was saying, you were dominating on both ends of the court. You showed strength, courage, and tenacity. To so later find out that'll be the last time your court breaks my heart. I know how hard for players to come to terms that way. It took some time, sir, but I've come to terms with my career. In truth, I was actually getting close to hanging it up anyway. No, I don't believe that for a second. What I do believe is the work ethic, the drive, and the dedication that make the player you are today. And those are the exact traits we need for as our general manager. You don't lose. I don't lose. The fans are here for hungry for success. The media is hungry for success. Every trailblazer wants to see our name in the headlines. Expectations. As an athlete, it's a term I've come to understand very clearly. Let's see, it's 1.50 p.m. You reckon about 10 minutes you'll be able to perform your first introductory press conference as the GM. This won't be a what, not one, not two type of event. They're going to come up with you some hard questions. Can you handle discomfort? I thrive in it, sir. Good, good. My advice, don't lie. Be honest. Be open. Feel free to tell what's on your mind, but protect the organization at all costs. Thank you for the advice, Scott. You've hired the right man. I'm ready to show the NBA what I'm capable of. Hmm. Hey, what up? It's Dane Dollar. I just want to holler about the changes, being famous, the pain and all the dangers. Emotion roller coasters being sought by all the strangers, getting tight with all my family. Hey Rick, uh, welcome. You touched on this in the opening remarks, but I'm wondering if you could, you know, uh, tell us more about the vision for the team. What are your goals for the season and uh, moving forward, Shane? Eh? We're in an interesting position this year. I know not everyone sees it this way, but from my perspective, we're only a few minor tweaks from getting the team where it needs to be. All of our guys can play. I have no doubt they can play. But are they the right group of guys that can take us where we want to go? That's on for me to that's on me to figure it out. Like any GM, I'll be evaluating as the season goes along. Ultimately, we got some nice pieces, a really solid core, and I think we're only a few moves away from being the best version of ourselves. Yeah, Rick, any thoughts on your head coach? Will you be looking to bring in your own people, or are you happy with Coach Thoughts and his staff? Hey. I have a ton of confidence in Terry. He's great with the players, he's great with the media, and he's one of the smartest basketball minds I've met. He's going to do a great job for us this year. Whew, I'm out of breath. Oh, I, I, I mean, uh, uh, welcome everyone to the Red Lounge. Rick Redmond here. So yes, we are rebooting and restarting this Portland Trail Blazers My GM Association franchise, we're going to call it, for NBA 2K18 this time. I know I had a series for this in uh, 2K17 last year, but we did. I didn't necessarily get to finish it. So now we're gonna just restart this over again on 2K18. So now, as you can see here, we are gonna look through our roster. You know, it's gonna be led by our two main guys, backcourts, and Damian Lillard and CJ McCollum. We got the up-and-coming rising center and Joseph Nurkic, and then just like a, a lot of young prospect, a lot of wingman, and it's just stuff we're gonna have to deal with and work around. Do this trade, uh, do this uh, season. Maybe we'll work on some trades here and there. There are a couple people I kind of want to eh, get rid of because their contract's a little bit huge. But we'll talk about that later down the road. We do have our season opening game. It's going to be on the road against the Phoenix Suns. I'm not going to play the game in this video just because we're already almost 10 minutes into this video and it'll be too long of an episode. So I'm going to save it for the next ep uh, the, the next video of this series. But uh, stay tuned for that though. And thank you guys for watching this this week's video or this this episode. Until next time guys, this is gonna be Rick Redman signing out.